It's the Messenger Show! Hey there, everyone. This is our gal playing the Messenger, and last time we got a big crown. There's room for one more note, and like one more item, <laughs> actually. Uh, yeah, and I got a windmill pinwheel, and yeah, honestly, yeah, I got, you know, a big old crown that would fit in this big old door. Although, uh, I don't know if I need to, like, talk to you. No. I want to open up this door. Yeah, there we go. So it does just kind of fit up. Well, there you go. The abyss stares at me. That's how you're going to put that? Okay. <laughs> and the shopkeeper's just... Where am I? Hey, little fairy. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, so not able to do this level until you, um, I don't know where I am or why I'm here, but I am. There's no map, so that's good. Prophecy? Press the wrong button. Oh, wait a second. So, Corrupted Future. Ooh, it's like the, that's the reverse tower. I wouldn't have thought. What do you have to say about the prophecy? Yeah, our pursuer shall send a messenger to the very future he meant to prevent. Yeah. So I'm in- I'm in my- I'm in the bad future. It's full of tentacles and people <laughs> falling into the pits. And yeah, there- oh, do, 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 check it out, I'm in a rectangle. And yeah, and there's a thing in place where you cannot progress until you've at least done the turquoise river. Oh, I freed you from amber, and now you can go into place. And then you're gonna go like, whoa, check it! Like, it's- I feel weird that I have to hit you with my sword to kind of get you going, to get you, like, getting your square going, but I get it, I guess. Okay, that was weird. Like, I was expecting to, like, fly off the lantern like normally I do when I rope them. I- that was not happening with that one. That's fine, though. Whoa, check it out, I got this thing. Okay, so there's nothing to find, there's no green, there is only progress. So that's going to slightly change how I play. I'm not going to be obsessed about the map, because there's no map. Remove the map, and I'm going to play in a very different way. Which is, might not be necessarily a bad thing. This is really cool, though. Just kind of carving our path here. Why is there a ring there? I don't know. Why did you do that to me, little fairy? Are you gonna, like, move and go, like, here or something? Or are you just the bad fairy that summons a wall at you? Maybe you are. Alright, you know, gonna need all kinds. Okay, yeah, some of these just don't lead anywhere good. And some of them just don't lead anywhere, period. Um, is there anything... Oh, no, there's a path behind you. Okay, sometimes there are paths, and I'm... I feel like I have trouble seeing them. Like, the, the big magic wall does look kind of solid a little bit. Alright, so, uh, you oh, you might be going down, and that's where I'm gonna go to be able to go. Yeah, you go down another path. Okay, so, no fairies are bad. No such thing as a bad fairy. It's just they gotta cooperate, and sometimes it's a little awkward. That's fine. Check it out, and I'm up here. What does that even mean? I don't know, cuz now I'm going down here. Alright, so I missed out on a bunch of lamps. I'm pretty sure I'll live. It's fine. Whoosh. There we go. That was the whoosh. Very glad to have done the whoosh. Yeah, everything... I feel like... Every... This level is making me realize just how readable everything has been during the whole game. By how kind of hard it is to read things here, but you know what, it's evil town. See, that's why we gotta prevent this bad future. This is the future where things are kind of hard to parse sometimes. Uh, Alright, you're here, there you go. I mean, the idea of these, like, spectral space paths through the through the toxin sludge is super rad. Is that, you know, okay, so yeah, you just made that happen, and I'm sure you're very proud. Yeah, there's nothing really else keeping anyone around here, and that's understandable, alright, so spike wall, well, nuts to y'all, ma'am. I don't need to pay attention to your cashew collection, I don't think anyone would, whoa, that, that thing gets purple when it's kind of slightly damaged. Alright, don't know what I'm doing at all. 
but that's nothing new. Alright, so we have to follow the path. Eyeballs blinking. Oh, we got like goat frog inside eye pupils. More frog than goat. Goat would be like a square. Hey, oh, what? Oh. <laughs> um, that was quick. I didn't. Okay. What is going on with the moon? That moon has seen better days. And uh, that would destroy the tides. I mean, that would destroy the planet. Kia Courage, uh, appearing only for the one would venture into the biggest unknown. Uh, yeah. And there we go. We got the notes. It was just a little, uh... Yeah, like I was saying. Oh, I don't know. Something's gonna something, right? If th oh, jeez! <laughs> oh, hey there, Monstron! Whoops. Okay, well, I mean, that just... Oh, that's... That seems kind of rude. But okay, understood. Oh, shoot. So that's why there's rings everywhere, and that's why there's this, like, this little passage here. It all makes sense. You just kinda have to go. Big ol' well thing coming after me. What am I gonna do about it? Yo, I'm gonna ignore that portal. Sounds like a smart thing to do. Okay, yeah, we're just going here. So this recontextualizes a whole lot. Alright, buddy. Look. Uh, uh, yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Use your rope, man. Rope is good. Yes. So the fairies seem to be actually, like, purposefully carving their space pass. Like, carving out where it is actually useful for me. Because now they're not doing fun, like, platformy shapes. They are letting me run. <laughs> Just go forward. So that part all happen. Oh, you ate the portal. That's bad. We kind of need that. I guess you cannot return. That's why there's no green coins in it. It's because once you're done, you're done. Never again. It's impossible to again. <laughs> it's a big whale. Big spiky bug whale. I got all of them. No, 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 we're not one step closer. We're, we got them all. Oh, <laughs> all right, good for you. <laughs> so if I press up, yeah. That is correct. Can I get the crown back? No. I mean, that's the episode. Uh, I guess to burn some time, we can see what happens. See, what it is actually in the sink, it is that uh, we can buy. Hey, friend, I got some money. I can buy a boss. Yeah, let's buy ourselves a demon king. Origin unknown, he is the one who brought the curse upon the human realm. Oh, then they go on the shelf. They don't, do they not do, like, fun stuff? So they're like little info blocks on very specific things. So this is it! That's what it's like to sink some money into a figure. Do you have anything to say about what's going on? Doesn't look like it. Does the orb have anything to say about what's going on? Turn to it after you have completed your adventure. Alright! Sounds great. Uh, I guess I can put the note back and we'll see what happens. Maybe that'll whisk me away to a magical world of adventure and folly. And frolicking. I doubt it. Get out of here, curse. I spoke over the melody. I didn't intend to do that. I just couldn't help myself. <laughs> what? Oh, no. Um... Messenger, it is time for the first of our order to share with you the origins of the curse. Okay, then. <laughs> so the shopkeeper is the first of the older. I mean... It's sad of me to say, but we are extremely approaching the end. Uh, what? <laughs> wow, you still... Uh, oh, is that... Mm, was that why there was tension all this time? You have to- you have to speak these things out. You can't let these things simmer. It's the worst possible thing you can do. Well, okay. It's behind us. That's fine. Alright. Here we go. Lore time. 
Oh, but we got a cutscene though, so it's okay. Ooh, look at that. Yeah, those are the three statues we see. So there's some giants living in the cloud thing. Okay, maybe those are. Maybe they are. Protecting the world from unknown forces. So this, like, the scene is scrolling. So I'm assuming I don't want a button. Yeah, the text is faded on its own. So I have no tell in how quickly this went. So the world suffered a massive flood. So, all right, the thing was cool. And there was a flood. Is that where we are? That kind of fits at the map if you put it sideways. Adaptive, yeah. Try to find new meaning. That, that does sound accurate, like given enough time. Wasn't aware that the messenger was uh, post-apocalypse. Starting to call these troubled times. A poor little couple stepped up to be their leaders. Alright, sure. This is giving me a vibe, but I'm not sure what. But there's a vibe. Voice and an ability to create mesmerizing trinkets. Okay. There she is. Phantom. Phantom and Muse. Oh. Merchant really can, like, paint a picture. Something <laughs> we have actual pictures. Oh, geez, okay, they just kind of flop here. Oh, that's too bad. Pictures soon to be extinct. Music fans find everyone to prepare for the inevitable onslaught. That's a fun word. The army was too strong. Skilled. That's unfortunate. Mesmerizing trinkets could only go so far. Not the fun creation. Keep us in a music box. Big old rose on it. Like little leaves. Bring the temple to the Demon King and the last five of his race, the western edge of the island. Yeah, that's where we were. That is accurate. And it did, so the temple was a forlorn fortress. Got it. While stand for sexual after instructions for people to rebuild and stay hidden, Phantom pushed his luck. Uh oh, what are you doing, Phantom? What? What are you gonna start here? Is it, no. I was about. Is he the first messenger? That doesn't make any sense. Start towards the temple. A foolish attempt to take down the demon king on his own, using his little ascot there, probably as a weapon. All right. Yeah, we can tell this isn't gonna go anywhere. So that. <laughs> All right. So it's always the same head that has a crown. All right. I mean, yeah, I'm not sure what he was expecting to happen here. I mean, that's what desperation does, right? Okay. Phantom's moving on to a tether to the human realm. So that's a music box probably we're gonna be playing. In 500 years, he would come back to torture humanity until he abandoned all hope and surrender. So that's why he's, like, not absolutely destroying everything and he keeps leaving people around. Like, the whole point is the suffering. You can't have suffering if no one's left. Huh. That's kind of terrible, actually. That's kind of mean. Um... Okay. How long has he been there? I want to ensure the curse is I guess he was maintained. By keeping... Playing. Looks so sad there playing the organ. So he started maybe the order of the messenger then. That's what it sounds like. Somehow. Yeah, like, 
I mean, across generations, every 500 years. 500 is a lot of generations. That's right, I wrote a scroll with enough power to tune its cured time magic. He still looks... He looks like a really sad Donatello. <laughs> Losing his mind completely, he teleports final hope of the scroll to his people's hideout. He's pretty lucky he was able to do all that, like, under Demon King. I feel like the Demon King just doesn't care. <laughs> hmm, 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 hmm. Not every mind could stand, which... Right? Look at all these guys. Those are all different games. That lady looks pretty modern, that's funny. Oh yeah, and then we got, like, fu future... Hey, that's that guy from Evil Zone. <laughs> the ability to step through space-time tears, 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 that access to the void, a safe haven outside of time. Right. Ooh, do you think that is my arch? No, but she's from before me. The samurai in that. Hmm. Oh. I... Okay. Time army. Well, that's neat. It's not a time. You know what I mean, though. <laughs> and thus the the test. Because yeah, this is them building the time tower. Conceal their appearances. Fair enough. Thus the uniform. I kind of gathered that, but they're spelling it out here, that's fine. Power of Time. I'm honestly surprised they're explaining as much as they are. This champion would join the order after passing the scroll to the... yeah. Look at that! That's me! Well, it's like a beefier me. That, is, that looks scary. It looks ominous. So, um, I'm wondering if, um, the intended for the note things to be gathered across different generations and not all at once like this. Yeah, they can destroy it, but with all the musical notes, they can open it. And that would hopefully deactivate it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I kind of, I kind of went ahead of the script there. See, look, a particularly gifted got two of them. I got the rest. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's a pretty cool scene there. Okay. This is what happens when you involve an actual player character. Oh, man. Well. <laughs> no. But... But it's pretty clear what we're doing next time, isn't it? Today, I gathered the last note block, note thing, musical note, and uh, next time, we're gonna play some music! Sounds great! Grab your shish kebab.